we're in my home park of Razor Rocks, and I'm going to show you the most extreme, ultra extreme roller coaster that I have actually built and saved design of. Uh, as you'll see, this uh, my home park here has the world's tallest sidewalks. That's our claim to fame. But it's none of those roller coasters that is the ultra extreme ones. It's this one that we're about to build. Today, we are recreating Top Gun, aka now known the as the Bat, at Kings Island on Roller Coaster Tycoon Classic. Welcome everybody to Roller Coaster Airtime. If you're new here, go ahead and take the time to subscribe if you think you might be interested in seeing other roller coasters recreated on Roller Coaster Tycoon Classic. Yes, these are real roller coasters in real parks. We are today at Kings Island again and we're recreating the Bat. Now this ride is a suspended aero roller coaster, not to be confused with the original Bat, which opened back in the 1980s, um, which was defunct and they actually tore down. It is built by the same company, is the same type of roller coaster, it's just this one isn't as extreme. Um, the original one had two chain lifts, this one is uh, the new one, it only has one. Again, it was formerly known as Top Gun, uh, it used to have a different color scheme, but now it is known as the Bat. Uh, in between being called Top Gun and the Bat, it was also known as Flight Deck for a little while um, until Cedar Fair got a hold of it and uh, switched it up for good. All right, so we're about halfway through this layout and I'm about to get real with y'all. Um, it's been one of those days. I just want to share my experience. Um, not the story itself that's important, but I uh, had a one hour chore of changing my oil and rotating my tires in my car today turn into a four or five hour ordeal because I broke a stud off uh, that got welded inside the lug nut and I had to bust it off. And if any of you have ever put a new stud in and through a wheel, uh, it's not always easy and sometimes you have to modify and that's where I'm at right now. You know, it really frustrated me and I banged my fingers a lot today and it's been one of those days. But I just want to take the time right now to realize that, you know, we can't let things like that take us down. I've got to still have a good day. You know, here I am. I'm happy. We're on Roller Coaster Tycoon. We're making a fun roller coaster. We're getting ready to see what some test results are going to be. It's all good. And there's so many people out there that we need to be praying for and thinking about instead of being feeling burdened and feeling worried about things. You know, just hand it over to God and be thankful for, for what you have. Now that being said, this video has been a pain to make tonight. It's just been one of those days. I have made this roller coaster, Top Gun, three or four different times and I just keep getting ultra extreme, ultra extreme intensity ratings through the roof. The pacing's too fast, it's too tall, too fast. I just can't get it right um, and it's been a struggle. So the fact that I just get it completed and we even have some test results is awesome. But here we're hitting the final brake run, and, which means it's time for the test run. Um, have some people, uh, I've had some people ask if we could do the original bat, and yes, I do have plans to do that sometime. Um, I'm going to do it on like a throwback Thursday. So if you are not subscribed and you want to, you want to see that, make sure you hit the bell that way you're notified every time I recreate another roller coaster on Roller Coaster Tycoon. Also, that being said, if you're enjoying this video and you're enjoying hanging out, uh, go ahead and smash the like button. That helps me out a lot. And uh, the YouTube ratings and the algorithms and all that stuff. Uh, you know how it is, you know how it is. But anyways, here we go. We're topping the chain lift where there's this little tiny pre-drop, a uh, classic for some of these aero suspended roller coasters. And we hit this first drop, which actually isn't as long as it is steep. Um, first little turnaround, and man, we're just moving. We're swinging all over the place. Pretty good pacing here. Not too wild. Now we're swinging awfully quick. We're all, oh, wow. Wow, that's swinging pretty hard there. At the end, um, okay. Let's just, let's see how we do. Let's take, go ahead and take a look at its actual stats first. So we like to do that. The real height of the bat is 78 feet tall. Top speed at 51 miles per hour. We do not hit the mark. Uh, we are just about right on the speed, but way too short. If I would have made this thing 70 feet tall, we'd be zooming. I mean, I don't even think uh, it would be on the charts. And see, here's the test ratings. I cannot get it 
Right, ultra extreme nausea. Extreme intensity. Medium excitement. Are you kidding me? This thing would be bomb. I don't know. I'm struggling with Roller Coaster Tycoon today. So I challenge you all, if you have any, I guess, tips to make this ride more rideable, I'm using my quotation marks, please leave that in the comments. I mean, I just can't seem to get it slow enough, I guess. Uh, maybe I need some brakes somewhere in the middle of the ride. I didn't see any in the POVs I watched and the layouts I've looked at. Um, but I'm going to blame it on one thing, and that's the brake run. Yep. Ultra Extreme, just that. Just that right there is Ultra Extreme. But, I believe that's the best part of the ride. Hit the like button if you agree with me that the best ride, the best part of the bat is at the very end of the ride where you hit the, the brake run and swing really hard back and forth. Hey, that's all I have for today. Good Lord willing, we'll be back with another one tomorrow, and I'll see you next time on Roller Coaster Airtime.